My name is Yannick Thompson. I attend Ohomo Technical High School. I will be running the 100 meter hurdles and maybe the 100 meters at the Wes and Girls Championship. Here with Yannick Thompson, IAAF World Youth 100 meter hurdles champion and record holder. Yannick, welcome. Oh, thanks for having me. All right, Yannick, Champs is a few weeks away, but as you know, Champs is short for Issa. Grace Kennedy, Boys and Girls Champs. Grace Kennedy being the, the title sponsors. Tell us basically, how do you feel about Grace sponsoring Champs? Well, it's really good to have a food brand sponsoring the championship. When individuals win their races, they can get to taste the new products and those stuff. Speaking about products, what are your favorite Grace products? Well, I like the mac and cheese, the sausage, and delicious juice. Okay. All right. Champs now, Yannick. We haven't seen you much this season. We understand that you had an injury. Basically, tell us where you are as it relates to recovering from that injury. Well, this injury is not going to recover that easily, so I have to run on it. But I'm not where I want to be, but hopefully by Champs I can actually be halfway there. So. Speaking of that, you won at Central Champs last week, 14.54. Uh, I figure that you're not pleased with that time. Well, I'm pleased because I wasn't running hard and I had to stop because of the condition of the field. So I'm pretty pleased with the time for my first race for the season. 12.94 last year. Record history. You're the first female to go under 13 seconds at the World Youth. Champs is around the corner. A lot of people are expecting great things from you. Yannick, how do you think you'll perform at Champs, especially with the, the nagging injury that you have? Well, I always go to Champs and do my best. I don't, I'm not going to take the additional pressure. I'm just going out there to do my best. And not because I did well last year, I mean I'm going to do well this year. I'm just going to take it a step at a time and just do my best. Speaking of doing well, you will have Claudette Allen you know, as an opponent to face. Maybe Peter Gay from San Diego, if she's fit enough. People don't expect you to lose now. Are you feeling any pressure? Well, it's always, no, I don't really feel pressure, but I always take my competitors seriously. And I, I like the competition because when I run in competition, I always get fast times. And when I get fast time, I know that I'm improving. So them being in the race is going to push me hard, to go harder and might run another fast time, who can tell us, but I'm just, as I said, I'm going to take it a step at a time. You mentioned the injury earlier. How healthy are you? At what percentage are you right now, three weeks away from champs? Well, I'm, I'm healthy. And the injury is not a new injury. It's the injury that I had from World Youth. I ran with it at World Youth, so I don't think it would be a big problem that I can't run with it at Champs. So I'm just nursing it and taking care of it, going to the feet and all those stuff, and just getting it ready for Champs. Yannick, a lot of people believe that you're the future of hurdles in Jamaica. How do you feel about that, and what are your main objectives beyond Champs? Well. I feel great to see that person that are looking up to me to do great things in the future and I want to live up to their expectation. So it's very good to know that I can go there and do things that other person cannot do. So my objective is just to work hard and just stay focused and just continue to do what I do best. Well said Yanni, can all the best at champs. Thank you very much. Uh,